Okay, so today we're going to integrate a custom AI chatbot into a Webflow website using Chatbase. This is one of the easiest ways to take any kind of personal or business website and give it powerful AI capabilities. For this example, we're going to embed a custom trained customer support agent that's been trained as an expert in sales. Before we get started, you're going to need to set up a Chatbase account to do this. If you don't know what Chatbase is, Chatbase is how you train custom AI chatbots on your own data and then use them to automate customer support, generate leads, and increase your team's productivity. If you want a full video breaking down the chatbot creation process, I will link a full tutorial in the description of this video. If you want to create your first chatbot for free, just go to chatbase.co to get started. All right, let's jump into my computer and embed a chatbot. So you're going to need a chatbot to do this, of course. Click on the chatbot and you'll see this top menu. From there, click the connect button, make your chatbot public if it's not already. And now here you can see the embed codes. There are two ways to embed a chat-based chatbot, one as an iframe and two as a chat bubble widget. The iframe can be placed anywhere on any page. The chat bubble widget will appear on the bottom right of your website. The chat bubble is usually better for general customer support, but I'll show you how to set up both. So first the iframe, make sure you copy this code and now let's jump into our Webflow site. For this iframe, make sure you're on the exact page you wish to embed your chatbot. Then click the plus icon to add an element to the page. First, drag a section element onto the page where you would like to add a chatbot. Then drag a container element inside the section element. Finally, drag a div element inside the container element. Now scroll down the list of elements, locate the embed element and then drag that onto the div that you added. Okay, the hard part's done. If you need to slow that down and rewind it and do it again, that's fine. Next, select and double click the embed element to reveal the HTML code editor. Now paste in the iframe code we copied earlier. Now all you have to do is click save and close. Now you should see a preview of the chatbot on the live preview of your Webflow website right inside the designer. Your chatbot should be ready, you just have to click publish. All right, now let's set up the chat bubble widget. This is a great option and it's actually even easier. First, go back to Chatbase and copy the bottom code this time. This widget will appear across your website, so we actually have to go to the site settings instead of a specific page on the Webflow site. From there, we go down to the custom code in the menu. Now locate the head code section with the custom code page and paste your chat bubble widget code that you copied earlier, then click save changes to apply the code. Now let's publish the site and check out the chatbots. As you can see, we have two different kinds of chatbots here. The iframe is embedded in line with this page and we can interact with it very easily. Then if I click the bubble widget here, we can see the other type of embed. This one looks great as well. And if you're adding a chat base chatbot for customer support reasons, this is the one most people will be looking for. Okay, I hope this one helped you out. Thank you for watching to the end. If there's a different website you need help embedding chat base on, or if you have any questions about chat base, let us know in the comments below. We're constantly adding new features and we have so many amazing updates on the way. So make sure you follow or subscribe to stay up to date on all of the new exciting things that are on the way. And if you haven't already joined, head over to chatbase.co to get started for free. If you want to learn more about Chatbase, watch this video where we show you step-by-step -step how to build chatbots for clients, or this one where we build a chatbot for a podcast. All right, thank you guys for watching. Have an awesome day, and I will see you in the next one.